I'm uh, Douglas Sook, uh, I'm at Boston University in the School of Education, and I'm involved really directing this new program called Global Ecology Education Initiative. And I've been a science educator there for about 25 years. Earth Care really gets uh, me out into the schools as well, uh, more with high schools, and we and I do a whole presentation based on my trips to the Amazon and other things that I've done that really gets into the idea of earth-centered ethics that we need to be caring about the planet much like we would care about a person or a friend. We have connections that we didn't even realize and one of the big ones that I always share with people who want to know what is global ecology all about and is that the, that the dust material, the little sand material that blows from North Africa uh, actually moves in tremendous amounts and major tonnage through the atmosphere and falls in the Amazon. And it's falling there and providing um, ultimately nutrients uh, that allow the Amazon to thrive. Who would have thought of that connection? The deserts and the rainforest intimately connected. And it's a lesson for all of us that the earth is, is smaller and more connected than we realize and that we're a part of that connection. I always say to my students and to friends, adults, any age, that we could never be perfect, we're always incomplete. We're, we're really not like a squirrel or a blade of grass. They are somewhat perfect, quote unquote. In other words, they fit. They fit into ecosystems. They don't, they don't emit tons of carbon. They don't make plastic bags. What's great is that there are so many positive um, actions going on around the world by peoples around the world. I think of the Barefoot College and the Himalayas in India, which has expanded. They really train women to be solar engineers, and the only way you get into that school is by being barefoot and illiterate. Every little thing we do matters in the same sense that there is no magical world, I, I say to people and in conversations. Um, there is no magical moment where everybody changes at once. It's all increments. It's all individuals doing uh, specific things.